Hi, my love bugs. I have a haul today. I have a Dollar Tree haul, a Kroger closeout haul. I want to call it a closeout haul. It's just pretty much everything marked down. And I also have some um, marked down things from Walmart. Not that many and not that many from Kroger, but I would like to share anyway. So I'm going to start with the um, Dollar Tree haul. So I went to Dollar Tree and of course I told you guys on the last haul, I was looking for these and like I told you, they didn't have them in the three that I frequent and they had them in the snack. This particular, um, the honey roasted pineapple haban habanero sesame chips, they had these in the, what they call that, the snack section um where those are but then they had the honey roasted ones and the apple cinnamon um just in the regular section so i was really happy to see these i love these i've been craving these and i'm happy to be socked up on them yeah okay so i have that and that can fall because i know it wants to fall i'm going to stay with the food since i just shared that one uh i saw this it's a organic crushed tomatoes with basil I forget this is organic and it's crushed tomatoes. I know that I'll be using it soon as fall. Like the leaves are already falling. Honestly, I am so ready to, <laughs> I am so ready to decorate for fall. I am excited, but I am trying to wait till fall actually gets here because the stores, my stores already have Halloween candy um, in the stores. Like they're not giving you a chance to just kind of ride out the waves of the little summer weather at all not at all so i got this and i was yeah it's california tomatoes organic for a dollar 25 you really can't beat that right now especially the news was talking about that they're going through a tomato shortage and oh dear um i got this as a backup i don't know how it tastes but it's a ranch extra creamy dressing and dip it's by valetti's and uh i just figured this can be a backup when I don't have like the Hidden Valley or the other name brands that I usually get and my boys can use this, you know, until I can get uh, get there. I've tried their tomato sauce. It's it's good. It's cool for like your homemade pizzas and stuff like that. But I really like a really gourmand um, tomato sauce for spaghetti, lasagna, stuff like that. So, but well, nonetheless, I want to try it anyway. It doesn't look bad. It, it actually looks good. So. We will see how that goes. My son really liked this. I got it in the blue one. The a blue one was blueberry. And this one is a this one is strawberry kiwi. It's, it's an electrolyte drink. Electrolyte. Electrolyte. There we go. Woo. Drink. Um I believe it's called Reward. And he liked it. I tried it. I didn't care for it. It wasn't nasty. It just had that aftertaste that I don't care for. So, so far we got the blueberry right now. We have the strawberry kiwi. So I need to find the coconut, the apple, and the aloe vera. Since he likes it, I'm just going to let him try all of them. So, and the sugars on it is zero. Saturated fat. Everything is zero. Um, yeah. That's that on that. Okay, uh, I saw these. The I don't even know how to pronounce it, but they're entertainment crackers. You get a variety pack. So I, I chose that one because of the variety pack. You get multi-grain, uh, water cracker, and butter crisp. Looks like this. You might see them in your stores. It has a really nice seal on it. Um, let's see here. Oops. I wanted to tear it neatly or open it neatly. I wanted to see what it looks like. Okay, so you get a seal that looks like this, and they come like this in a row. So it's kind of like when I mean, you open it, you really don't know what you get because it's not, it doesn't say. This is not for individual retail sale, but you don't know if you're getting the mold, the, um, the butter cracker, and I'm sorry, butter crust, water cracker, or the multi grain. So that will be the only thing I don't like about it, but nonetheless, it's my first time and I wanted to try this brand. And as you can tell, I'm running air hungry because everything seems to be food. I saw this. This is a family size Reese's Pieces, uh, Reese's Pieces, limited edition Reese's Puffs bunnies. My boys already got into it, so I wasn't able to share that one the last haul, and that's already gone. So I got another one and yeah so it's pretty good for um a family size one pound 
and they like that as in the of course uh this is flavor i believe uh that's the end of the food haul i believe uh let's see i got this adult tea i thought this was pretty cool it's just a black and white adult tea by american apparel which we know american apparel has a name brand and i'm really happy to see that because i can dress this up this is for me <laughs> so it looks like this really soft so i got that and they had this was in a oh this one is a, me a medium so this is the size so if you like something like that this is really nice i have been enjoying a lot of their uh, t-shirts i try to get the soft ones i like their soft ones um Gold, gold toe has a lot and those are really they feel really nice um, so I didn't even know this was actually American Peril I honestly thought it was um by gold toe but I am not mad at all and it came in this really nice sealed package so that's that I got another one of these I like to change change these out so it's been a year and I just got that um, to put in the sink and I also got this I like to change it out as well so I was glad they had the mesh strainers back let's see I thought I was happy to see these because <laughs> they have always had the pair of soap in there the gold um the gold one let me see can I move this without moving that out the way I'm sorry guys now I'm moving you guys out the way a little setup here okay we're back okay so they have the pair of soaps sorry about that the pair of soaps and this one is pure and gentle with lemon flower extracts and the blue one will be the pure and gentle with mint extracts I know this is this soap is it's, it's in a pack. I mean, it's in, always in a plastic pack. It never came bare, like just out of the pack or in the box. It comes like this, but it's you know, it's been around for a long time. But I honestly don't remember trying these. It was always that golden one, so I wanted to try these. So I got those two, and I was really kind of shocked to see this these are going on amazon going on amazon for 19 dollars sd they're going for 15 20 um you know so it's an um aloe vera soothing and moisturizing gel it says pure cold pressed aloe vera extract hand from hand-picked aloe vera plants and let's see it just simply says, experience the wonderful benefits of nature's miracle plant through the cellular aloe vera soothing and moisturizing gel enriched with vitamins and nutrients that are beneficial for the skin and hair. This magical elixir is indeed a must have for your daily self routine. Cold pressed to keep only the highest quality nutrients. Okay, so it says suitable for all normal to sensitive skin types. There is no sticky filling or residue and will dry down on skin. And I wanted to open it. I was kind of, cause when I looked online, I saw like the body wash and all that and the body wash was a little higher. But again, this is online. And I just wanted to see it. So this is good for this weather bites. Um, your skin, your kids play sports, work out. Oh my God, this is beautiful. Look at that. So this is not the one I saw online, but, cause I think the other one I saw online was body wash. But this, is, look at that, that's so cool. So you can use it for your body and your, um, so it's, it, oh, I like the back. Um, it has, well, I can't show you, cause you're not gonna see it, they have, it tells you what it does for the body. It says for soothing results and softer skin, apply generously on clean area and allow to dry. May also be used as a remedy after sunburn and after shaving moisturizer. And for your hair, it says massage gently into scalp before shampooing. 
may also be used as a leave-on conditioner to treat damaged hair or hair loss. I mean, I'm sorry, or hair loss. And for your face, it says apply a generous layer onto freshly cleanse, I'm sorry, clean face and leave on the skin for 20 to 30 minutes before washing off. That's pretty cool. So the ingredients are good. You got your aqua, which is water, your aloe, your leaf extract, um, the ginkgo biloba leaf extract, all that other stuff that probably keeps it, you know, to last long, all those words, Lord have mercy. But that's that, let's see. I mean, it's so packaged. It's packaged really nicely. I'm not really mad at the packaging. I like it. I really do. And I want to try it out and come back. And uh, let's see. Oh, it has a seal. That's so good. I love that. I absolutely love that. Oh my God, honey. This, okay. Oh, wow. It smells like a really light lemon verbena. It doesn't say a scent, but oh, this smells really good. I like this. So far, I don't know how it will be on me. So let's see how that, I'm going to put some on my hand and then continue with this haul. I'm sorry it took so long on this product. Oh, it does feel like a, a um, Okay, in there it smells like lemon. When it comes out, it doesn't. Let me see what it feels like. Um, I look moisturized, even though I had my own stuff on. I'm glad it doesn't have a loud smell or no smell at all. So if you have allergies or you don't want nothing to, you know, like I always talk about, I'm sorry, you guys, I'm just wasting stuff, but you know, Interfere with your perfume or cologne. This is great. I'm trying to see now. Because it said no sticky. I feel the word that no, a lot of people don't like. I feel moisturized. How about that? Okay. So we're going to put that to the side and see how, like, if it starts doing some weird stuff. I do believe that is the end of the Dollar Tree. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to just go on to Kroger. Uh, you know how Kroger has their clearance section where in the produce, every section has produce has a clearance section and every Kroger or Smith have their own little section where they put their mark down. So this was only a dollar, which is great. They look really nice, hearty, and it's pretty good for a dollar for these because yeah, a bag of these would be more. I also got the kind blueberry almond. These usually go for five dollars, and I got them for two dollars. My son is going to love this because he's he is a um, blueberry freak. No, I don't want to call him a freak. He likes blueberries. This one is a grape. This one usually goes for two seventy nine. They mark these down for one thirty nine. They also had this. I wasn't sure if this is good, but in Kroger, this goes for eight twenty nine. This is just the Avino Daily Moisturizer Sheer Hydration. It, it's fragrance free and they marked it down to 335. So that again, that is still good, fragrance free. And shockingly, I have never tried the Goldie brand uh, gummies. Um, I usually do Ollie. Um, yeah, Ollie multivitamin. So this is the Goldie Superfruit Gummies Beauty Wellness Nutrition. You get 60 pieces and I got this for $5.59. This usually goes for $20. And this one is the apple cider vinegar. This one goes for, of course, $20. They marked it down to $5.59. They had the ashwagandha for calming and all that. I usually don't have a problem. Um, so I didn't get that because I usually, I don't understand it that well. It's it relaxing and all that. And I didn't think I needed anything like that, so I left it for, you know, you know, they had a lot, but, you know, I just didn't get it because it was there, so. That's the end of the Kroger markdown. Uh, okay, so Walmart has a lot of uh, markdown groceries right now in their freezer section, so if you guys frequent um, 
your Walmart, please check the refrigerated sections. I just got these because I went to a neighborhood Walmart. I didn't go to the super Walmart. I'm pretty sure I would have had more than a lot of the variety, but these were only a dollar. This is the chicken pot stickers. You get eight pot stickers. So this was a dollar. So I got some of those. And I wanted to share the ravioli. This is the beef ravioli. This is only a dollar. I'm sorry, this is only a dollar as well. So I just wanted to share that because I know everyone don't frequent, you know, Dollar Tree a lot and stuff like that. And we all have different grocery stores because we live in different areas, different parts of the state. So I just wanted to share that. And oh, this is my favorite lip gloss. Like, oh my God, it's so pigmented. It's it's like if you don't like lipstick or anything, but you want something with a really nice color, a really nice blush color, I like this one. This one is by, I'm sorry, this is from Dollar Tree. This one is by um, Believe Beauty. I am so glad I gave this a chance. I had to find another one. I was so happy when I found another in Dollar Tree. This one gives me high-end vibes so much. Um, I don't know what it usually run for online, but this one is called, well, the color is Mimosa. But boy, I love this lip gloss so much. Like I reach for it, like I go for it. Like all my high end, I just scoot those out the way and I have been reaching for this one. And this one is uh, something new. This one is Lip Luster by Femi Contour. And this one is in Berry Twinkle. This one has, it's a lip gloss, but it has like some little light specks. I'm sure like if you turn a little, it won't be like like too much, but this is what this one looks like. And I didn't want to open that one because I haven't used it yet. But that is the end of my haul. Talk to you later. Bye.